Nets walked off the Orioles last night, and this one is brought to you by manscaped.com slash John Boy. This pitcher's name is Cesar Valdez. He throws a changeup 81% of the time. It's below hitting speed. They call it the dead fish. I think that's it there for ball one. This is his fastball, and it gets absolutely smoked to left field, but does it stay fair to tie the game? Mets are down one in the ninth. Oh, Conforto knows it. Nimmo thinks it went fair, though, because the ump say it went fair for a little bit. And these guys, Peterson and Nimmo, they hug over it. These guys are going crazy. Let's go, Mets. Let's the ump say, wait, 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 wait. Let's make sure we get this right. I think that was a foul ball because the cameraman, he had a good view and he acted upset. And like, okay, yeah, foul ball. After that, Valdez didn't throw a single fastball again. He went dead fish the rest of the inning. Look at these pitches, just like below hitting speed. That one gets by the third baseman though, so they got a runner on first base. Bam, now that runner's on second base. First and second, no outs. Rubbing the ball to head, feeling the luck, having fun. Just got to bunt him over. Whoa. What's that? What's that? You kidding me? Oh, 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 two. Oh, no. The f- dead fish gets him. The fans are frustrated. Dom Smith, pinch hit, falls down 2 0, and now they're rolling. Now we're feeling good. 2 0 pitch pops it into right center. Real nice piece of hitting. The dive doesn't get there, but you love the effort. Pinch hit, game tying double. For Dom Smith, that's the good stuff, folks. Dom's awesome. Everyone's cheering. These kids having the time of their life. That kid holding up the other kid. Big high five. We're about to we're about to get such a big high five and they cut it. I mean, look, wait, wait, look at that dad behind him. He's freezing. The guy's freezing. He's clapping into his breath. And then then there's the redhead on the right and this dude. They are about to have just an awesome high five. Look at this. But the camera cuts away. So now the go-ahead run is on third base. And they're shifting all the way to the right side because the lefty's up in his fourth ever plate appearance. Fourth ever plate appearance for this guy. Pat Mazika, I believe is his name. I'm not sure on the pronunciation. He's just seen the dead fish over and over and taken what looked like pretty gnarly hacks. That's a foul ball. Okay. Counts two and two. That's in play. Play at the plate. Mets walk it off. Ump says safe. VR does a cool jump. Mazika says, what of it? Come and get me, guys. This is where it's pretty fun. Look, they're all excited. Now pay close attention. You got Alonzo on the right. He's about to jump the railing. Now his right hand, he tro- goes to plant it on the railing. His right hand here. It kind of slips right there. See the right hand? He's looking for grip. It slips off. Left foot gets stuck. Alonzo goes down hard. Not that hard, but over on the other side, and Nimmo's jumping fine. I think this is Peterson. <laughs> he, he tries to jump the rail, and his right hand also just doesn't get railing. He, he's expecting full support here. Doesn't get any support, and he's going to go down too. So two Mets down in the celebration. Who the hell cares? They came back and won it in the ninth, and that's the story. And the story really is this dude, Mazika, who's now shirtless for the second time, looking like Doolittle Light, just living the life, man. Two walk-offs. They rip his shirt off. Who ripped his shirt off? Let's go check it out. I think it was Nimmo. I think Nimmo's involved in everything here. Tosses the helmet. Okay, Lindor got to him first. And then it's Nimmo and the dude, the other dude in the hoodie. I don't know who that is. But, man, you got to take a look at this dude. He's gotten four plate appearances this season in three at-bats, and zero hits and three RBIs. And a couple days ago, he had a walk-off fielder's choice in the same manner, just a dribbler right into the ground. And when he got asked about it, facing the dead fish, what it was like, this was his response. Well, I was trying to hit it straight up in the air, and I hit it straight into the ground for the second time in a row, but uh, we got the job done. And you got to love the honesty there. He wants to hit it up in the air. Instead, he's just chopping the grass, just like you should be doing with the Lawnmower 4.0, Manscaped's new product, and you can get 20% off and free shipping at manscaped.com slash John Boy. Clean yourself up. Have some fun. Mets are winning games. They're having fun, crazy storylines. A lot of good times in Mets land right now.